Welcome everyone. Today I'm going to show you a brand new feature that was released in Canva a couple weeks ago. That feature is called Magic Edit. Let's see how this works. So here is a picture of Green Bay Packers quarterback Aaron Rodgers. If you read the rumors, as of April 2023, he's about to be traded to the New York Jets. So I'm going to use the new Magic edit feature to replace this helmet. So let me show you how this works. I'm going to select edit photo and I'm going to choose this option, magic edit. From here, it's going to be very similar to magic erase. I'm just going to highlight the image that I want to replace. In this case, it's going to be the Green Bay Packers helmet. So once you have your, your object highlighted, just go ahead and select continue. And now I'm going to type what I want to replace that object that I highlighted with. And here it is. I'm going to replace the Green Bay Packers helmet with the New York Jets helmet. Let me select generate. And in just a few moments, Canva is going to use AI to give me a few suggestions right over there to the left hand side. Okay, here we go. Now there's a couple that look very similar to the Packers helmet, but check that one out. It gives me this option or it gives me this option. So a helmet that looks kind of similar to the New York Jets, really easy to just shade something and replace it. This, this option is a lot easier than using a program like Photoshop. And of course, if I don't like this result, I think it doesn't look quite as realistic as I want, I can always try this again. So a really quick example of how you can use Magic Edit to correct something. Now let's go to our next photo. Here is a man working at his computer. A few different ways and I'm going to try this Magic Edit tool. Let me try and let's let's change his hair. So his hair is looking kind of uh, kind of plain. Let me go ahead and uh, highlight his hair a little bit. Should I maybe make it longer here too? Okay, I'll kind of give him sort of longer hair. Okay, so here's what I have. I'm going to give him a rock star hairstyle. <laughs> okay, and it gave me a few different options for his hair. I don't know if I like any of these, but I'll just leave these the way it is. It almost looks like it gave him an earring. Is that an earring or is it his hair? I can't quite tell. Uh, so a few other options on here. This young man here. Let's go ahead and try Magic Edit. I think what I'm going to do is to replace this flower. Let's see if I can maybe replace this flower with... Let me try to place the flower with a baseball bat. Let's see what happens. There we go. <laughs> Not too bad. Uh, now let me try this again. I'm just going to, to try that again. I have an idea. I'm going to select Magic Edit again. Can I replace this outfit that he's wearing? Let me try to replace this outfit with a black tuxedo. Okay, some interesting results. I think I like this one the best. And then finally, a more traditional photo. We have this woman who has a empty hand in this photo. I can easily use magic erase to highlight an area. Kind of like this. And what I'm going to do once I shade in this area... Let me go ahead and type in a stack of pancakes. And there they are. Now, I'm not quite sure what this blue stuff is in the middle. But of course, if this isn't something that I like, I can... And there they are. Now, I'm not sure what these blue objects are in the middle of those pancakes. So in this situation, I'd probably want to try this again or add more detail to my prompt. But this is called Magic Edit. It's a feature that's available in Canva. It's one that you'll definitely want to try out, especially if you're interested in AI or generative AI. So thank you so much for watching this video. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment section below.